Documents obtained by TV1 News showed several transactions of monies from this 22.7 million kina paid to tailoring companies, hire car companies, guests' houses, phone house, resorts, hotels and motor vehicle companies. Those same people that we're going to do a we're going to do a research, we're going to do a search on all these companies. Who owns this company? Where the money are? Where the money is? And what happened to those money? We, we're, going to do a, we're going to do a thorough investigation on all this funding. So the whole, when you look at this, the whole 22 million were paid to only one region. A lot of the farmer lists that I, I have here, they said throughout the country. It's not throughout the country. I've got the whole long name list here. It's only between Eastern Highlands and Jiwaka. Included also were three separate transactions under the component of Paymaster paid out on 4th of June 2021, 26,000 kina, 11th of May 2021, 30,000 kina, 23rd of May 2021, 60,000 kina, total cash payout of 116,000 kina. The minister alleges the funds were paid to employees of the Department of Agriculture and Livestock. Minister Simon added that several names of coffee exporters listed to be recipients of the monies were not known by the Coffee Industry Corporation. The minister further alleged that the Department Secretary, Daniel Kombuk, is responsible for the misappropriation of funds. Both Minister Simon and Secretary Kombuk have filed separate complaints with police to investigate the misappropriation saga. Jumaima Sukbat, TV1 News.